in the second part of the topic atmosphere today i will take the composition of atmosphere then what is the difference between weather and climate and about the uh, pressure and local winds so uh, in the last chapter we done the layers of atmosphere so today first of all let us do the composition of atmosphere composition of atmosphere that how many and how much gases are available in atmosphere so this is our earth which is surrounded by a blanket of gas this blanket of gas is called atmosphere this blanket is made up of many gases which are for example out of total 100% gases the maximum gas is nitrogen which is 78% approximately nitrogen is very light gas so basically it is found in the upper part of the atmosphere second important gas is oxygen which is 21% of the total gas oxygen is a very heavy gas so basically it is found near the surface of the earth and the importance of oxygen is that green plants that uh, all the biosphere found on earth is just because of oxygen humans and animals take oxygen from animals from air sorry as they breathe green plants produce oxygen during the photosynthesis in this way oxygen content in the air remains constant if the cut trees then this balance get disturbed now let us come to the third important gas and this third important gas is carbon dioxide which is only 0.03% though carbon dioxide is very less but it is very important gas green plants use carbon dioxide to make their food and release oxygen human or animal release carbon dioxide the amount of carbon dioxide released by humans or animals seems to be equal to the amount used by the plants which make a perfect balance in the atmosphere and remaining are the other gases these other gases includes it is of 0.04% include neon neon helium and etc gases sorry composition of atmosphere now let us come to next topic and that is that what is the difference between weather and climate if we come to weather then weather is hour to hour or day to day conditions of the atmosphere a hot a humid or a rainy weather like today and uh, next thing is that a pleasant breezy weather may make one cheerful and even plain for an outgoing weather can change dramatically like at present the weather is very sunny but just after one hour we see rainfall now let us come to the climate or other climate climate is the condition of atmosphere at a particular area for a short period of time uh, basically here the geographers the scientists count 35 years they take the 
that was of 30, last 35 years of weather of a particular area and accordingly that they declare the climate of a particular place let us take the example of India now in India we see all six major seasons but all over we see in the six months we see southwest monsoon winds going toward this side and the remaining six six seasons we see the northeast winds winds which call monsoon winds so all over here we see the monsoon winds in India and that is why the climate of India is called the monsoon climate so that the major difference between the climate and weather is that weather is for an hour to hour or day a day or a day to day changes while climate is a short period of time which is approximately short period of time not a short period of time in a particular time area where scientists are taking data for the last 35 years and then they declare the climate of that particular area now the next thing which is left in our chapter is air pressure pressure means weight the pressure we feel like I am standing here and the whole weight which I feel of air is the pressure of that air now if the air is one uh, one kg here the amount of air is one kg then I feel one kg weight of air but if air spread to other sides then maybe I feel 800 grams of weight means I feel less pressure now why I feel less pressure First of all, see, let us see the relation between temperature and pressure. If pressure is temperature is high, then we feel temperature low. On other hand, if temperature is low, then the pressure is high. Now, if temperature is high, means because the temperature is high, the air heated and scattered with the air scattered to other sides the pressure goes down that's why we feel less pressure but if the temperature is high then air from other sides comes to these sides and we feel more weight of air so means the pressure is high so the relation between the temperature and pressure is just opposite to each other so pressure is the weight of air many times air goes towards horizontally at that time we feel less pressure when air goes towards up upward sides because of the high temperature at that time also we feel less pressure many times the air comes towards the surface of earth during that time we feel high pressure and also when air from other sides come to a particular side means a high pressure area during that time also we feel a high pressure because of this pressure temperature yahan par high ho gaya obviously pressure become low here okay, the temperature is low then the pressure is high means now the air goes from high pressure to low pressure so just because of pressure the air moves from one side to another side another side which is our next topic wind wind means air air which moves from one side to another side just because of this pressure of high and low pressure on earth winds can be broadly divided into three types the first type is called permanent winds 
so permanent winds means winds which are flowing all over years these are like deep trade winds westerlies wind and polar winds now the second one is the seasonal winds when we see winds flowing from one side to another side in a particular season only as we see it here in india in the six months wind goes from one side to another side which season is called monsoon season or rainy season on other hand when wind goes from one uh, northeast to southwest this particular season is called the retreating of monsoon so these wind is called seasonal winds now next one is the local winds we also found some local winds which blow only during a particular period of the day or a year in a small area for example the land and sea breeze the hot and dry local winds uh, which are called a loo in the north western part of india that is punjab haryana and rajasthan these are called the local winds so this is how we complete our chapter atmosphere